Hi, I'm Lance Davidson, and today I'm going to show you how to microsurgically isolate the mesenteter mantle. You're going to first see me take a blunt forcep and do take off the vitellin of the embryo with the pointy forcep. I've also placed the embryo on a, a petri dish, and it's against this sort of backing backstop here that you see at the bottom of the screen. I'm going to first make an exploratory cut to see where does the mantle, um, where is the mantle in this embryo. I found that it's a little higher than I thought, um, so I'm going to start making my, uh, my incisions a little bit lower. The incisions are done using a kind of a, a, a maneuver that's a lot like ripping stitches, um, if you've ever done that with uh, sewing. And I'd recommend checking out how to rip a stitch in order to understand truly how you're, you're able to cut through just the ectoderm. Now I'm going to be peeling off um, the animal cap from this embryo. Notice that um, the cap actually covers some of the mesenteter mantle itself. And now I have an embryo that's basically had its cap removed. And you can see the blastocele there, that cup-shaped uh, structure. And you can see around the margin of that cup, uh, the edge of the mesenteter mantle. And now I'm going to start to remove the mantle from the rest of the embryo by making an incision first, sticking the hair loop, hair knife in, and then cutting the, the mantle away with the hair loop. Uh, turn the embryo again and repeat this process until I've got the mesenteter mantle co nearly completely uh, detached from the embryo. At the end, you're going to have a little bit of additional um, cells, that, the tissue that has to be cut and uh, to completely free the mesenteter mantle and separate it from uh, the blastocele floor. So the idea is not to, not to um, include the blastocele floor but rather to remove it. And so at this point now, I've got the uh, mesenteter mantle around the ring, um, and it's fully isolated. I just flipped that mesenteter mantle, um, so the rough side is the part that faces, um, that I just dissected from the embryo, um, and the smooth side uh, formally faced uh, the animal cap ectoderm. You want to place it, this explant, um, so the smooth side is against your fibronectin coated substrate, and then at the end of this movie, um, I'm going to show you just a beginning of how to cover slip that, um, that frag, that, that mesenteter mantle to hold it in place.